What's up guys, Shiny Enter Zach here back with another TCG pack opening video. This is actually my third video opening up the still unreleased set Primal Clash. And this, once again, is what I'm going to be opening. This is the only way to get Primal Clash right now. And this will be, I believe, the only way to get Primal Clash until the very first possible day anyone should be able to get this is January 24th when pre-releases start for the set. I believe they're going to be the 24th, the 25th, the 31st of January, and then the 1st of February. So the set comes out on February 4th, and I'm sure we will see packs of these come in blister form and maybe some boxes or other products around maybe the Monday or maybe that last pre-release day because they always come out a little bit early. But this is the only way, my point is, um, this is the only way to get them right now. These are $4.99 and only at select targets. I Trust me, I had to go to a lot of targets to find any of these, but I've already opened the others up because it takes a long time to uh, open all of these. You open them from the bottom like that, and then they come with this little uh, binder with 60, you can fit 60 cards in here, I believe. The back has the Hoenn starters, Trico, Torchic, and Mudkip, and then the front has Primal Kyogre and Primal Groudon. And I like this design, actually, this background on the front. It's pretty cool. And then all of the different types of energy in the TCG is on the side here, if my camera will uh, pick up on that. I'm not sure that it will. There we go. So that is what the binder looks like. I now have quite a lot of those, so I may have to figure out something to do with them. But let's put the DS down. I have my 3DS XL. And these are all for the pack arts if you haven't seen them yet. And if you haven't seen my other two videos, please go check them out. Also, if you enjoyed this video, I'd really appreciate it if you'd leave a like rating on it. That really helps me out and it really motivates me to keep buying these products for you because they're not cheap and motivates me to give you some guy, you guys some great content. So let me just go in whatever order I have here, starting with Primal Groudon. Lots of these cards are still new to me and I'm hoping to pull something amazing out of these packs. I think in each part I've pulled something pretty nice, so please go check out those other parts if you have not already. So we have Trico, Tangela, Skitty, Horsey, which I like that artwork a lot. Spinda! Oh! Pokey Collection will be really happy. I might send him all the Spindas that I pull, or most of them. I need like at least one for my set and one reverse. Then we have Masquerain, Groudon Spirit Link, that looks really cool, and Bibarel. My reverse is a Swampert, not bad. This is one of the two Swamperts in the set. This one is the and just normal rare one, and then there's also a three-quarter art one that might actually be playable, but this is a rare, so that's very nice. And my actual rare is a Diggersby. Oh, I didn't know there was a Diggersby in the set, and this one is Fighting. I believe the last Diggersby we got was a normal or a colorless card. So we have Ear Dig, Flip until you get Tails, for each Heads, discard the top card of your opponent's deck, and then Hammer in for 70. Um, but yeah, just a regular rare there. Let's go ahead and get this next pack out here. We have a Shroomish. Oh, that looks so cute. There's a bunch of Shroomish in there, and they're in a forest. This is really well done. I like that. Zigzagoon, Weedle, Bunnelby, Trico, Masquerain again, Archie's Ace in the Hole, and Celio. There's also an Archie's Ace in the Hole full art, which I might want to pull. My reverse, oh, that looks so cool. Three quarters are Torchic with uh, those little flame, uh, it says flare bonus, I guess those are little flare bonuses that it's shooting out. Flare bonus, discard a fire energy from your hand. If you do, draw two cards, and then claw off with a coin. If tails, this attack does nothing, but it does 20 damage if you get heads. But it has alpha barrage, this Pokemon may attack twice a turn. If the first attack knocks out your opponent's active, then you can attack again when your opponent puts a new Pokemon in the active. So it's good to get this in reverse, and it looks great, too. And my rare is an Azumarill rare. That's kind of a cute card. I like that. So, two regular rares. 
Not the best polls. I was thinking uh, before I started this opening that uh, it would be pretty disappointing if I got subpar polls just because I went out of my way to get one of every artwork. But I hope that won't be the case. Surskit, great artwork on that. Meryl, Torchic, Slugma, Illumise, Macargo, Neoqueen, and Acrobike. Look at the top two cards of your deck and put one of them into your hand. Some people, people are debating this card a lot of whether it's going to be playable. Uh, my initial reaction was that it wasn't that good, but in thinking about it a little bit more, it could be very useful in some situations, so we'll see how useful it ends up being. My reverse is a Nidoran female, which is just a common, and my rare is another regular rare, this time a Kingdra. There's also a three-quarters art Kingdra that is also going to be our pre-release promo for the set, so it'll be the first time we've had one of those like a three-quarter art card as our pre-release promo, so I'm excited for that. And that Kingdra is actually decent. I have to get something to end this video off. I need some last pack magic or something. We have here a Shroomish, a Zigzagoon, Weedle, Bunnelby, Trico, Dive Ball. Oh, this is my first one of these, and it's such a good card. Search your deck for a water Pokemon, reveal it, and put it in your hand. Shuffle your deck afterward. No caveat, no drawback. Just get a water Pokemon out. And this is going to shake up the format a lot. It's going to make Primal Kyogre possibly playable. It's going to make Empoleon pretty good again. It's going to make Seismitoad even better. So watch out for this card in decks coming up when this set is in the format. Whizcash and Shield Energy. One of the new special energy from this set. My reverse is a Hone Edge, that is just a common. And my last rare for this video is a Swampert, which we pulled uh, in reverse earlier. So, not the best pulls this time around, didn't even get a Hollow actually. But, these are the rares we got, Diggersby, Swampert, Azumarill, and Kingdra. And then we got some interesting reverses as well, including this 3 quarter art Torchic and the rare Swampert. So that's going to do it for me. Thank you guys for watching, please subscribe if you haven't already. Like and favorite the video and leave a comment below. And until next time, I will see you guys later.